Yo, what's going on, everyone? It's V8. Back with another one. This one's gonna be straight to the point. They will never be able to understand us. They will never be able to figure us out. Why? Because we're too advanced. Who am I talking about exactly? I'm talking about the chosen ones. Chosen ones being red pillars and narcissists and agents and spies being blue pillars. Blue pillars will never be able to figure out red pillars. But on the contrary, red pillars can figure out blue pillars because all of us were once blue pilled. We were all brought into this world as a blue pillar because all of our parents were blue pillars. Now, this red pill philosophy, it's been around for ages, but it's now more important than ever because things in the world are changing rapidly. And in order to survive, you have to adapt. And red pillars are the first to adapt to change. Blue pillars are gonna stay the same. And then they're gonna shame you for doing what it is you do. Whether it's your skills, talents, hobbies, they'll even shame you for the way you look or the way you were born, which you can't do anything about. But when you hit them with real facts, they can't handle it. They behave like a female. And then everything they hit you with, shaming language, most of these things can be changed. You know, money comes and goes. You could always get more. But your personality, your character, that's a little harder to change. Some people are just going to act that way till the day they die. As sad as un unfortunate as it is. Some people are not going to change. But it's not your job to change somebody. So, another thing blue pillars don't understand about red pillars is that we put God first. Blue pillars put women first. So if you're putting women first, that means you're putting women above you. That means you're not putting God above you. That means you're not living for the most high. That means you're not even putting yourself first. In what world do men put women above them? That is some simp bitch shit. When you see a dude putting females over him, do your best to avoid that person because they are not in touch with God. They don't know the divine order of their own creation. I mean, it goes man, then woman, then children. Not woman, then man, then children. Also, women, as hard as they try, as much as they want to be, they cannot be red-pilled. Because women are agents of the state. If the government has women's back, that means women are blue-pilled. That means they're agents of the state. And a male feminist is a blue pillar. Therefore, he is also an agent of the state. He is a spy. And all these blue pillars, spies, agents of the state, all they do is watch the chosen ones. They, all they do is watch red pillars. They don't wish the best for you. They just want to see what you're up to. And it's like, I don't even have a second of time out of my day to watch what a simp blue pillar is doing because I know that they're living life in the most basic of ways. They're not advanced like us. They're not complex human beings. They're, they're basic. They think in a group think uh, as a collective group. Basically, they're liberals, they're feminists. 
They just do what everybody tells them to do. They don't have any identity. And then they try to mold you to be the person that they want you to be. And then when you refuse their ideas and say, I'm going my own way, I'm on my righteous path, I'm in touch with the Most High, my life has a purpose. When you tell them that, they get mad for no reason other than they want to manipulate and control you. The same way where they manipulate and control the skies with these chemtrails, that's what the blue pillar wants to do to you. Lie, cheat, steal, manipulate. And then when you don't let them do that, they get upset. Well, fuck them. Let them get upset. Nothing's getting in my way. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. I was put on this planet because I have a, a calling. I have a purpose. Blue Pillar's purpose is to enslave. They're trying to hold us down. They're trying to keep us from reaching our full potential, which is unlimited. It's limitless. And they know that. They feel threatened by that. They're going to try and keep you from reaching your full potential. I'm not impressed by how much money a person has, how many fat bitches you got with. I mean, the shit that Blue Pillars brag about, I'm repulsed by. And they don't understand that. Because you got to live with an abundance mindset. Yeah, I got money, but I'm getting more. Yeah, I've had bitches, and I know there's more out there. Yeah, I got two V8 Jeeps, but I know I'm getting more ill cars after. A blue pillar, or a simp, is going to have a scarcity mindset, thinking that there's limited of everything. And if you think like that, you're gonna lose forever. Because there's a whole lot of everything out here. So, yeah, blue pillars will never be able to figure out red pillars. We're too advanced, we're too sophisticated. We've been through the war and we survived. We came out on top, we came out alive. And they hate that, you know, they want to mold you into the person who they want you to be because really deep down inside, they're not happy. And they think because you're not chasing pussy that you're sad or you're miserable. No, not at all. That makes me the happiest person in the world because I'm not having the enemy come into my life and try to complicate it because we already know life is complicated. It's stressful. I don't need any additional stress. And that's what blue pillars do. That's what females do. That's what spies, gang stalkers, narcissists, and agents of the state do. They make your life more complicated than it needs to be. It's not a big deal to cut someone off or push someone away. That's the difference, is that blue pillars need your energy. As a red pillar, I have tons of masculine energy within me. So I don't need somebody else. I don't need to feed off someone else's energy. I got a ton of my own. And I like my alone time because that's when I can really manifest greatness. That's when I'm in my prime, when I'm alone. These blue pillars can't be alone. They need another energy source to feed off of because their light is dim and my light shines bright. And they know that. And every time you level up, there's gonna be a new devil, a new agent. A new spy, a new gang stalker. I'm telling these blue pillars, man, I don't spend a second of my day watching you. But I know these blue pillars are watching me. They watch me like it's TV. I know I'm putting this content out there knowing that some people are gonna like it, some people are gonna hate it, not everybody's gonna agree. But at the end of the day, you're still watching. So I must have valid points. And look, to end it, 
these blue pillars really do feel threatened by someone who exercises their true, complete freedom. They're jealous that you're a free spirit, you're a free soul. I call all the shots in my life. I don't let people come into my life and call the shots for me. So my advice to you is take the red pill, stay red pilled, and stay away from blue pillars because they're just jealous of your light. They're trying to steal your energy. You're a very powerful energy source when you're red pilled. And blue pillars are the devil. Their father is the devil, father time. So know the difference, chase excellence, chase greatness. Stay away from blue pillars, man, they're cancer. I'm trying to stay cancer free. Life is too good, it's too beautiful. Don't have people waste your time. Stay in your own lane and perfect it. Keep building. It's V8. I'm signing out. Peace and blessings to everyone. Stay away from blue pillars. They're very dangerous. Peace.